have this flawless thing. Dude, I I got the oh okay, so you can just oh wait, there's ranks for trials. Wait, what? Oh wait, so you rank up by getting tokens. Oh, dude, I have two hundred tokens sitting here. Okay, so there's a ranking system. Okay, well, there's a gold shell available for us, so. Random mod. Um, okay. So I'll pick up the ghost. Let's see what perk we get on it. I'll mute myself now. Improve solar analyzer. Generate gunsmith telemetry on solar weapon kills. All right. Okay. So we also got Titan cash detector. You can put a gel on it. Okay. I want this shot, but reach, reach rank 5, reach rank 10. So there's a ranking system now. But it's basically, it's based on handing in tokens, and I had tokens sitting around, so... Obviously, right now, I'm getting all old stuff. Oh, there's a new shader, though. Oh, but I can't pick the main shader. Let me make space. Fucking shader woes, man. The shader woes. I'll delete that one. Hopefully, I'll get more of that shader so I can preview it for you guys. So, good thing I saved tokens, man. Okay, again, I've just got old, you know, these are old weapons, pretty much. Um, even the light level on this is not great. Okay, actually, let's keep going, though. Let's go up to the next platform and see what we get from here. Those of you who are watching on YouTube, I am streaming this live on Twitch right now, and I'll be streaming Trials Help over the weekends. I always do that. Uh, might do a little bit of raids, a little bit of uh, even competitive. I've done a little bit of competitive as well, i.e. the rank crucible game mode. Um, and yeah, they've added a ranking system for trials now as well, but it's just based on packages. Oh, there we go, I got that nice cool shader. Uh, I don't know what light level that chest piece is actually in, which is for us. Um, let me have a look at this shader though, because it does look, it's got a bit of purple in there. You know I like my purple. Wait. Did that go to the postmaster too? It did. That is annoying. <laughs> um Turn the music down. Shit, okay. Hopefully I haven't been uh, too quiet so far in the video. But yeah, we're just looking at the loot anyway, so I now have another tier reward. This is basically for getting to seven wins i guess so i can pick up this k9 rising sparrow and i'll have a random perk on it okay have a look at that also i'm going to delete all this because we don't need these 350 scout rifle 342 i don't need that i'm going to delete that um i will probably put this end scout into my purpose because that's probably the only scout rifle i ever use uh, so we'll have a look at that real quick. Let's infuse it. There we go. Light level gains for you. Also, don't need any of this, so I'm gonna delete those two. Um, anything else so far? Just blues and stuff so far. So it looks like basically the ghost, the sparrow, and the ship are available through leveling up the ranks. So, not leveling up the ranks by getting to, obviously there's three, five, and seven wins. So for three wins, you get the ghost for five wins. You got the sparrow. So I'm assuming here at seven wins, what we will have available to us is the, um, the ship. Let's look at the trial ship. Okay, so there's no ship here. That's so just, just a gun. Again, this is a good way to level up, so I think what I will probably do here is... Well, actually, no, wait, there's the ship, actually. Burning Bright Tiger. Okay. Okay, okay. Adds a special flourish to your transact effect. Oh, 
shader on it. It's probably okay with the trials of the rage. That looks pretty nice, actually. Alright, we'll pick that up. We've got the ship. What's the perk? Add a white guardian crest to your transmit effect. Veterans Flare. And what, what perk did the trial shade have? Increased agility while airborne and an improved propulsion unit that has received some specialist tuning. Damn. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> All right. Uh, do I have any other shaders I can just get rid of here? Let me get rid of this. I, I really want to see what that shader looks like. I might just fly us to the tower. I don't get any more of the shader. Um, so if you guys are wondering, so the ghost, the ship, and the sparrow, the ghost you get at three winds, the sparrow is available at five winds, and then the ship will be available when you hit seven winds. Um, let's have a look here. And then this loot is essentially, it's essentially just the same as it was really. I'll take the helmet for leveling up purposes. Oh, there's an exotic ghost for going flawless. Okay. That's interesting. There's an exotic ghost for going flawless. She. Have a look at this. A night piece shell. This actually looks kind of cool. Omni telemetry generate guns for telemetry data and elemental level kills. All XP gains increased by 10%. Mm, that is pretty nice. And it looks pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not a big I'm not really into cosmetic stuff that much, but this looks cool. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie to you, but does it look more better than the disco ball? I don't know. We'll keep it on for now. Alright, so I'm gonna hand in my tokens now. So we've got more loot really underwhelming at this point to get season two and one weapons i'd have no interest in any of this now i had all these guns but here we go motion to vacate i can pick this shotgun up now let's have a look at it Ooh. let me infuse the sudden death into my unification now okay so let's have a look at the motion to vacate this is a brand new weapon guys I'm only available season three trials you have to turn in five packages and you can get your hands on this thing so you have an option of moving target or side shot i would probably go with i don't know it's not confirmed a side shot actually does anything but if it does i would probably go with that um oh actually this is interesting it has different swap weapons much faster for short duration after emptying the magazine that means you can go back to your primary after using all your ammo, I guess. We've got Flared Magwell. This is interesting. I've never seen these perks on the left side of, a, of, a, of the column. Um, I think for PvP, you'd probably go with Swap Mag. And then you have an option between Slide Shot and Moving Target. I mean, take your pick, really. And then Opening Shot, Improved Accuracy and Range and Opening Shot of Attack. It's not a Slug Shotgun, but I think Opening Shot giving you a little bit of range, maybe sliding and then going with opening shot, I don't know, it could be good. It's a high rate of fire shotgun. See what it looks like with a couple of different shaders. Uh, I'll stick that on it, I might use it actually. Game or two. Okay, so the next ones are available at 10 and 15. I don't think I'm gonna hit that rank, but I'll turn in these packages anyway. Okay, we got a masterwork. Sniper. Oh, we've got that shader now. I can finally look at the shader. I wanted to do that for you guys. Ignition of the nine. Where's the purple? Um, I, I mean, with my armor, that does not look so hot. Let me have a see what it looks like on a gun. Okay, I, I, I mean, maybe you guys are into that color scheme. I'm certainly not. Purpose, another masterwork. As you can see, handing in these tokens does get you a lot of masterworks, which is nice. Um, 
So I'll get all that. I think I might hit um, 10 with we'll pick up the SMG. Okay, we got a couple more masterworks, which is nice. All right, so we've got access now to the SMG. Okay, so have a look, let's have a look at this then, shall we? It's a 900 RPM kinetic SMG. So it would be most comparable to uh, the new city. Um, let's have a look. Where is my new city? I can maybe pull it out and we can have a look and compare. There we go. Wow. <laughs> okay. Well, this is well. New City is adaptive, and this is lightweight, so it's a different archetype. So it's kind of okay. New City has like double the range of this weapon, which is kind of interesting. Let's see a look at the perks. So, wow, this is interesting. So it has ricochet. You have. They've definitely switched up the perks a little bit here. You have a choose choice between swap mag, and now we've got ricochet rounds or high cal on the first barrel so they've changed it up there that's nice actually and then you got sideways and dynamic sway reduction i'd probably go with that and then zen moments a good perk this could actually be a good gun um put a shader on it oh okay it looks like that with a shader oh that looks cool i'm liking that guys i might actually get a weapon review out on this video then maybe tonight or tomorrow um I like the look of this SMG, I really do. I'll probably use it in Trials some. And we're going to be playing Trials live on Twitch, continuing to do so. I'll probably go out my Hunter next though to try and get more tokens. Try and get my hands on this weapon. Okay, so this is the final weapon. We need to reach rank 15 to get this weapon, which means we need to turn in 15 packages. It's a high impact energy scout rifle. I don't think there are any legendary high impact energies in the game currently. That's interesting. Has drop mag and kill clip. Moving target. Slide shot. I think, okay. I think drop mag, moving target, and kill clip. That could be a pretty cool combination. And I'm going to try and get my hands on this weapon for sure. But um, yeah, there you go. That's the season three loot for Trials of the Nine. It's probably, you know, there's probably more new loot elsewhere on offer in the game. I think there's not that much going on in Trials. There's no new armor, there's no new ornaments for the armor. So it's these three guns and then the cosmetic items that you've seen, that's what's new. It's not much, but it's something. It's better than nothing, I guess. And yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed me showing you the loot and I hope to see you in my next video. Peace. Alright, okay. Awkward moment where I'm on YouTube on Twitch is over now.